Right, Rubies. Come on, bunny up. Listen up. Week two. Oh, God, it's gone quiet now. You can't spread out a bit. I think this is it. <laughs> We've got a few that cried off from last week. So as we everything, it's either all or nothing with this group. Right then. Same one as last week. Um, a little bit more cardio into the warm-up. Right, throw your arms over. Come on. I can say you can spread out a bit now. We don't have to have the we don't have to have the dragons lined up in front of the camera. That's what, that's always good for viewing figures. That <laughs> and back the other way. Nice and high. Make sure you get your ears right up past your arms right up past your ears. <laughs> Been sent away to your knuckles, love. Right. You can't hear any of this, Subies. Right, feet to shoulder width apart, arms out. We're just going to go one knee to the other. You can dip your knee into it if you want. So just one side. Make sure you get a good rotation. Sorry about the noise in here tonight. The noisy ones are back. It's that, it's that Kate. Oh no. Right, up again, feet. Just over a shoulder width apart, just rotate. Just go a little bit wider. Follow your head, follow your arm around with your head. Get a good rotation. Use your arms to drag you round. That's it, get that lower back nice and loose. <laughs> I've just seen one on there that I've forgotten about. Right, step forwards, arms up. You know this one, just a nice gentle lunge. That was a warm exercise I put on with the skipping rope, but I forgot to get the skipping ropes out. Don't matter. Make sure you bend that back leg. It's just a half one, but just make sure you back bend the back leg. Drop your pelvis straight down. So you're not sort of rocking forwards. You're taking a step and then dropping down. Right, another two, one, two, change legs. And another two. Right, just flick your heels up. Nice and light, side to side. Put the dip in. We're going back to the eight in the aerobics. <laughs> It's mandatory, you've got to do it in time to the music now. Another two, and then we bring the elbows in. Elbows. <laughs> Rabbit head like froze. <laughs> Just ready to stand by. <laughs> Just press his reset button. <laughs> Keep going. Right, another two, one, two, right, start walking around. Uh, that way around, anti-clockwise. Zoom his own walk around, just nice and relax first. That's it, right, on your heels now, straight legs. Just on your heels, keep your toes up. Right, change your toes. 
stiletto walking. Make sure it's nice and light. So if you get me out, you'll get a nosebleed. Right, small steps now. So you're going straight off your front toe, exaggerated roll, heel to toe. Squeeze your butt cheeks when you're doing this. Steady on the omi, don't fall over. Oh, Kate's gone, look at that. <laughs> Nailed that. <laughs> Right back to a normal walk. Just walk back round to your normal place. Right then, so we're doing the same drill as last week. So it's targeted strength exercises. But in between each one, we've got some cardio stuff just to keep you nice and warm and to keep your fitness up because I need to get your cardio up for the Christmas stuff we're going to do. Do you know what's coming? No, this is the Christmas stuff you're going to do before Christmas. Because you know what's coming? The 12 days of Christmas is coming back again. <laughs> and I'm either going to use the one we did last year or I'm going to write a new one. <laughs> but either way, you know it's going to be painful and horrible anyway. So, <laughs> Right then, first, uh, three times by 30 seconds, star jumps. Nice and light. Three, two, one, go. So nice and light. Keep it on your toes. That's good, it's time with music halfway. Last 10, keep it going. Four, three, two, one, and off. That's it, just keep moving around. So this will get your heart rate nice and good for the next one. Reset. I'm gonna try and get my timing spot on this week. Yeah, right, okay. It's it's nice it's nice to have it's nice to have goals even if they're not achievable, right? Off we go. Second set. Three, two, one, go. Remember, nice and light. Kate, Kate, Kate's off on a random motion thing again. Absolutely well done, Debs. That's nice and light. Make sure you guys don't touch down. Keep on your toes. It's a lot better than normal. It usually sounds like heard the baby elephants in here when you're doing this. Three, two, one, and off. I say keep moving. Right then, last set. Three, two, one, go. Let's see how Zoomies are doing. Hi, Angela. Good to see you sneaking. Oh, we're back in the we're back in the gin palace again. Well done, Steve. That's it. Nice and light. Well done, Julia. Remember, if you are struggling with the ankles, you can walk this one out. Last 10. Pick up the pace. Come on, faster, faster, faster. That's better. Let's hear them arms slap. Two, one, off. That's it. Walk it off. Get a quick breather. Get into an easy one next just to get your breathing back. Right, so a hip hinge for this one. So Zoom is at home. People who weren't here last week. Stand on one leg. All you're going to do is you're just going to reach forwards and down. Lift your back leg up so it stays in a straight line with your torso. We're going to do 15 seconds on one leg. Just going down, up, down. As soon as you get 15 seconds, we're going to change over to the other leg. If you start to get unstable and wobbling like I was then, don't go as low. But just make sure your leg is coming up behind you. I'll, I'll change you after 15 seconds. So we're doing 15 seconds. Oh, no, we're going to do 30, weren't we? Yeah. So, yes, 30 seconds each leg. Right. Three, two, one, go. 
Yeah, I can. I do remember now because it was too. It was too short. You only got about two out. So remember, only go as low as comfortable. I'll give you a tip with these because I do these a lot at home because I do my homework. Slow and steady and build up the depth you go down to. You might not be able to get all the way down to start off with. But you're, by the time you get to the end of the 30 seconds, you should be able to get a lot further. Three, two, one. Right, change legs straight into the other leg. That's it, zoomies, you change the other leg now. So remember, take your time with this. Feel for it as soon as you start feeling wobbly, then come out of it. It's okay to have a slight bend in your knee as well if you want. It, it does actually help your knee strengthening if you have a slight bend in there. If you lock it out, all you're doing is stretching your hamstring. If you have a slight bend in your knee, it lets you build up those strength muscles around your knee, which is what we're after. And off. Look at that. Bang on 30 seconds. Ooh, that's it. Walk it off. We've got another two sets for them to do. I like them. They're rapidly becoming one of my favorite exercises. Right, second set then. First leg, go. 30 seconds. Take your time with it again. Feel for it. Once we get good at this, I'll start introducing water bottles. You should be able to get about four or five in in the 30 seconds. Take it nice and steady. Make sure that leg is coming up behind you. Last five seconds. Two, one. Right, change legs. Other leg, straight over. That's it. Well done, toppers. Watch that. Look at that knee. That's your proprioception kicking in there. You can't see what Tupper's his legs doing, but that's exactly what I want to see. That's all them little adjustments are your proprioception kicking in to keep you upright. That's trail running for you. That's exactly why she's good at it. Because she don't run on roads. And off. Well done. Look at that. Bang on 30 again. So zoom as you can see that, top as his legs, you can see we're making tiny little adjustments just to keep the balance going. So everybody stare at top as his legs now. I was just saying, everybody stare at your legs. Right, last set. <laughs> now you need to know what the dragon's doing, come and do it in front of the camera. <laughs> and then moan at me when it's all on the internet. <laughs> well, you stood in front of the camera. Right, three, two, one, go. Last set. Take your time. Nice and slow down. Make sure that back leg's coming up as well. All sorts. Ten. I'm over this. Three. Two, one, change legs. And off you go, straight in. Look at that seamless change. So you'll notice you've got one leg weaker than the other. Apply the view because your knee's weak. Or you've got poor ankle muscles. This is my weak knee. This is one with all the nuts and bolts in it. Last five, four, three, two, one, off. Say, so shake your legs off. Right now, we'll go back into some cardio. Right, okay. You're all right. All right. Right then, jump squat. I want to see some decent air on this, right? I don't want to see you just putting effort in like that. I want to see you getting right down. And seeing how high you can get. Because if I look at Kate, I'll end up on some wild flowers. <laughs> yeah, just like that. Right, so jump squats. Remember, all the way down, straight up, land, and straight back down again. Oops, I lost my mic pack. Right, 30 seconds. Three, two, one, go. See what the zoomies are up to. That's it. 
Yeah, Steve, good move there. I didn't want you putting your fist through your ceiling. That's it. Well done. That's good, Angela. Well done, Julia. That's it, Alex. That's exactly what I want to say. It's like Tigger. <laughs> so it's a combination of your arms and your knees and get your timing right and your launch. That's it. Spawn toppers. Well done. Well done, H. And off. That's it. Just walk it out. So this is like what we're doing for the last set. This is, this is polyometrics again, or plyometrics again. It's that explosive power. It's your fast twitch muscles. You need your, even if you're doing endurance, you need your fast twitch muscles as well, because they complement your, your slow twitch muscles. Right, second set. Three, two, one, go. I say, well done, Angela. That's good, Elaine. Well done. What's Jenny up to? That's it. All right, you can get a little bit more. That's good. It's good timing. That's it. A bit higher then. Last five seconds. Come on, get some good ones in. Well done, Debs. Remember, as soon as you land, try and land and go straight back down again. Because that's all part of the three and off, sorry. <laughs> that's all part of it. You go up, you land, you go straight back down again. That control is like negative lifting. Just walk it off. These are the ones you'll feel on the uh, Wednesday morning. Right then, last set of these. Three, two, one, go. I do like them. <laughs> That's it, Claire. Well done. That's it. Straight into it. As soon as you land, cushion it and straight back down again. Last three. Keep it going. You'll get two in. Two, one, off. That's it. Walk it out. Easy one next. You're going on the floor to get, grab your mats. Zoomies, we're going on the floor for the next one. Right, I'll face you so you can see what I'm going to do here. Zoomies, if you didn't do this last week, just watch out. So you start high plank. I want you to take your knee to the, this knee to this hand. Right, so you end up like there. Don't care where this foot ends up. You can get it around there, that's good. If it ends up there, no problem. All you're going to do is just drop your body down and then back up and then do the other side. Get as low as you can get. Back up the other side. So take your time with it. Feel for that stretch. If you want to take an extra two seconds, stretching it, stretch it. This is really good for your IT band. Right. Oops. 30 seconds. Remember, same knee, same, same hand, same knee. Three, two, one, go. Same hand, same knee. That's it. That's it. Yeah, and then just drop yourself down and you should feel it in your bum. And then back up and change legs. That's it. So it's just like that, down, as low as you can. Back up, same again. And back up. Take your time. Feel that stretch in that position. Down, stretch, back up. Pigeon stretch is excellent, whether it's dead pigeon or live pigeon. Well done, Tuppers. I think Kate's good at these. Yeah, there you go. I knew she'd be good at it. This is one of those yoga stretches. And off. Sorry, we've gone a bit over there. This is one of those yoga stretches. So when you see somebody do it, you think, I can't do that. It's actually quite easy. Most people can do it as long as you don't care where your foot goes and your foot will come. As you get better at it, you better move your foot around. 
Right, second set. <laughs> 30 seconds. Three, two, one, go. Right, so it's same, same knee, same hand. So take it up to the back of your hand, right? So get it right on the back of your wrist, as far as you can get it, and then just drop down, squeeze, get a good squeeze, and then back up. And then same again, take that knee to the back of your wrist, down. You can say squeeze. <laughs> As you get better at it and you get more mobile, you'll notice your bum can get lower as well. So when you do that squeeze, try and push your bum down. Two, one, and off. One more of them to go. Really good exercise. I'll, I'll think about it. So you might, if you've been running with T, she does it stood up. So she does that one. That, that's an upright pigeon. We've done it where you lay on your back and you reach through, grab your leg and pull it. That's a dead pigeon. But this is just not this is just normal pigeon. No, normal, normal pigeon pose. Normal pigeon. Right, last set. Three, two, one, go. So that's it. Get it up there. I can tell, I can see the ones who do it a lot anyway, because they can get the bums right down. They can get right on the floor. So the full progression of pigeon pose is it's all the way up, leg all the way down, and then it's that. That's what you're aiming for, is a full forehead on the floor. That's it. <laughs> Two, one, and off. I think you'd be surprised. It's, it's actually quite easy to get from where you are now to actually fall down. Right, back up. On your feet, kick your mats out of the way. Right, some more plyometrics now. Nah, sorry. I've got plyometrics on the brain. So these are slightly different to the ones we were doing last week. So step back lunge. So nice long step back, down into your lunge, and then you're gonna come up, jump, straight down into the other one, jump. So it's just 30 seconds, jump, land as straight down. So it's straight as the other one, as soon as you hit ground, straight down. Right, three, two, one, go. Any problems, or you feel your Achilles or your ankles, just go into doing normal step back lunge. Don't put the jump in. So it's, the plyometrics bit of this is the quick shift of your feet and that explosive drive up. Right, it's week two as well now, so no leaning on your knees, Alex. <laughs> That's it, just, just do what you can get. If you can't get all the way down, it doesn't matter. If you want to do a short one, two, one, off. We're slightly over. Four seconds. So if you are struggling, just don't do as big a lunge. Just do a smaller lunge. So it's easier if you do smaller. If you want to make it harder, go longer. I'm more bothered about it being nice and fluid and nice and quick. Right, three, two, one, second set. Off you go. Let's see what the zoomies are up to. Well done, Steve. I figured Steve would be good at this. He's got quite he's got quite good explosive power in his legs. I've seen him running. That's it. Well done, Angela. That's good zoomies. Everybody's doing a good exchange there. Yeah? That's it, Nick. That's good. That's all I'm looking for is that quick exchange. And then straight down into it. So you're not landing, stopping, and then going down. It's a and off. <laughs> Four seconds of it again. <laughs> You're only four seconds over. It's progression. <laughs> it's it's progression. <laughs> right, one more set of them to go. Just walk around a bit. Get your breathing back. I want you a full force for these. 
These and the jump, the jump squats are the ones that are going to get you on Wednesday. Right, three, two, one, that's it, off you go. That's it, well done. Just take your time. If you find it struggling, you keep practicing it, your neuro muscular will catch up and it'll start to become, that's a lot more fluid now, isn't it? Does that feel better? That's, yeah, that's because your fast, your fast twitch muscles are starting to switch on. Right, five seconds. Three, two, one, and off. Well done. Tough one, that. Looking a lot better. Right, back down on the floor again. It's a good job Meg's not here. He'd be moaning at me, all this up and down. Eh? <laughs> These are push-ups, but from the knees. Right? So when I say from the knees, I want you to make sure your body's straight. So I don't want your bum up doing it. I want you to see if you can do it with your body straight. Hands underneath, hands directly underneath your shoulders. You'll find it easier. And then all you're doing is just going down and up. Right, ponytails do not count. Nick, ponytails don't count. It's got to be your nose that touches the floor. What? Not yet. Go. All the way down. Moobs and boobs don't count either. <laughs> I see, keep it going. It's a nice steady pace for these. Just check your hands and make sure they're right in line with your shoulders. Two, one, and off. Well done. So just shake your, shake your arms, get your triceps going. Well done. Oh, look, little Angela. <laughs> I like it when we get little Angela. Right. Three, two, one, second step, off you go. Let's see what's going on. That's it. Anybody's finding these really easy, you can do them from your feet if you want. We've got no Lee here. Lee, Lee likes to do them from his. <laughs> Last 10. Nice. Just keep it out. Let's keep it going. Same pace. Two, one, and off. I say just shake your arms out. All right, Nick. <laughs> Have you been training here? <laughs> right, last set. Three, two, one, go. Make sure you're looking in front of you at 45 degrees so you're not dipping your head down to get an advantage. No boobs and moves first. Three, two, one, and off. Well done, just shake your arms out. Take a breather, get a drink if you need it. You're still on the floor for this cardio one. Right, I don't want any cheating on this one. No. Mountain climbers, but I don't want any cheating. I want you to do them like I do them. So they're inside mountain climbers. So it's nice and light. Drive them knees straight forwards. So we're not doing that kind. It's this one inside. Nice and light on your toes. Want to work them hip flexors. Right, are we ready? Ready, Zoomies? Ready, Roomies? Three, two, one, go. Quick exchange again. It's a fast one, it's a cardio one. So I don't care if you're going a bit short, I just want it fast. If you can get them all the way, the further you can get them, the better. 
Oh, oh KK doesn't like these. <laughs> What's he doing now? Two, three, two, one, and off. Hold on, everybody stopped early then. It doesn't work like that. <laughs> we play out. Don't let don't let me get me whistle out. <laughs> <laughs> squeak when I walk. Right, second set. Three, two, one. Off you go. Pass it in time to music if you can. That's the rule. Well done, H. That's it. Get a rhythm going. It's nice and light on your feet. It's a cardio one, this one. It's not a stretching one. Halfway through, keep it going. That's it, Claire. That's a good pace. Just keep it going. It's quick and light. Come on, we haven't stopped yet. Three, two, one, and off. <laughs> That's it, get a breather. You like it, really. What? I, I'm going to say. <laughs> right, last set of mountain climbers. Nice and light. Try and keep the pace going all the way to the end. Three, two, one. Oops, go. <laughs> that was a bit of a naff whistle. <laughs> That's it, Debs. Good pace. Keep that going. Keep it light. That's it, Kate. You've cracked it now. Have you found on switch on your trainers? Oh no! They've, oh no! It's the, the curse again. I looked at her and the shoe fell off. Last ten. Come on, keep it going. Pick up the pace now. The last time you're gonna have to do them. Come on, right on time. Two, one, off. <laughs> Stay on floor, don't disappear with your mats, you still need them. Right, nice and easy this one, it's just 30 seconds, low plank, but we're introducing a foot roll. Again, if you've got problems with your ankles, just hold a low plank, but I really want you to have a go at this. So all you're going to do, zoom is you can watch it first. Normal low plank, and I just want you to rock forwards, rock backwards. Yep. Just forwards and backwards. That kind of pace will do it. It's all you need to do. Right, get yourselves ready. Three, two, one. Plank, off you go. 30 seconds. That's it, just rock forwards and backwards. So it's, it's a little bit for your ankles, but it's more for your obliques and your abdomen. Because what you're doing is you change your position. So you're going to have to tighten that belly up a bit more now. Make sure you keep that bum down. I don't see any tower bridges. That's it. You all suddenly started dropping your, your bums down. Three, two, one, and off. You weren't the only one, Ellen. <laughs> when I said it, there was, there was about four bums all, all of a sudden went down. I'm not, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not going to, I'm not going to chug you under the bus. Because the bus was driving under some of you. It's cold, am I? <laughs> right, second set. You're all looking way too happy now. Three, two, one, go. Let's see what the Zoomies are up to. I am watching the roomies, though, on the camera. That's it, Steve, spot on. That's exactly what it should be. Just make sure your bums aren't drifting up. You keep them nice and flat. Should be a straight line from your shoulders to your ankles. That's it, well done, Julia. Oops, you just collapsed. <laughs> Another one that's cursed. <laughs> Last 10, keep it going. That's it, Kate, that's lovely and straight. That Well done, and you tuppers, that's good and straight. Two, one, off. Three, 
It was one second over. <laughs> you, you lot just can't count to ten in your heads. <laughs> One elephant, two elephants, three elephants. <laughs> right, last set. Up you get. Come on, plankers. <laughs> three, two, one, plank. Plankety plank, plankety plank. <laughs> Alex is praying. It's not going to get any better, mate. It's no good praying. <laughs> Come on, Jen, get your bum down. Don't let Kate distract you. As soon as you turn your head to talk to her, you ask us all. Three, two, one, and off. <laughs> what it is is your mouth is connected to your heart, obviously. <laughs> Right, flip over. Bicycle crunches. Bicycle crunches. Right, so those that can't remember what bicycle crunches are, the trick with these. So, elbows out, feet down. All you're going to do is you're going to bring this knee in and this arm across. You're going to roll. You're not going to lift like that. You're just going to roll. So all you're doing is just rolling from side to side. Right, so the biggest mistake everybody does with this is they try to lift the back off the ground. All you're doing is just rolling from side to side and then bringing your knee to your elbow. Right, 30 seconds, three, two, one, go. That's it, Alex, apart from whooping your dad in head. <laughs> That's it, Jenny, well done. Kate's nailed it, she likes these. Kate likes these. I mean, um, Ellen likes these as well. Tuppers is in the zone. Look at that. <laughs> You're all doing it in time to music again, aren't you? Two, one, off. Well done. That's looking a lot better. <laughs> right. If you want to make these harder, you need to embrace the Jerry. You need to. Who's seen Jerry do these? It's, it's like watching a Marine, honest to God. She's, she's awesome. She's awesome. Mick just took a walk and I went, I'm not even going to try. <laughs> she, she's, an, she's just an absolute machine. She... She come for um, four, 12 days of Christmas two years ago, didn't she? And Anna come, you know, Margaret's uh, granddaughter. And they were having a race head to little Anna was going against Jenny. Took her out in the end. <laughs> right, you're distracting me. Right, second set, go. Sorry, Zoomies, they were distracting me again. I see Elaine, that's spawn, that's a good rhythm. That's good, Julia. I'll, 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 I'll have a guess that Angela's doing it because little Angela's gone now. She can't grass her up. <laughs> Keep going. Three, two, one, and off. Well done. Do you not like them, Claire? They're not your favourite thing, are they? Right, I'm going to watch you next now. <laughs> You're all right down there. <laughs> oh, uh, we must have auto track or something going on. Right, last set. Three, two, one, go. You really don't like them, do you, Claire? <laughs> <laughs> just just try and roll on your shoulders and, and everything else and just let your knees follow. <laughs> yeah. 
Last five. Keep you going all the way to the end. Two, one, and off. <laughs> when, you, when you turn around and look, you know, like when you go on the Beatles and you put it on his back and it's like, <laughs> that's, that's what it looks like. <laughs> <laughs> I've lost where we are now. Oh, oh, I like these. <laughs> right. Shoulder taps from high plank in bear hold. Yeah, I know. Yeah, yeah. So something for everybody in this. Right, so bear holes. I'll do it two ways so you can zoomies can see me. So take, start off in tabletop, high plank, stick your toes, flex your toes, lift your knees off the ground, lock your core, and then all you're gonna do is touch your shoulder. And you're gonna try and keep your knees as fixed as possible. So you almost have to pedal on your feet, alternating. So for this side, it's like that, knees off the ground. Try and get it so you can take longer and longer and longer doing the shoulder tap. Right. Three, two, one, go. I guarantee you'll feel this in the top of your hip flexors and your lower abdomen. And he's got these nails. So there is a trick. If you put your feet a little bit wider and your hands closer together, you'll find it slightly easier. If you want to make it harder, bring your feet in and your hands wider. You've got to use more of your core. But if you're struggling with it, just start off that way first. Three, two, one, off. You're supposed to wait until I get to off, not when I start counting three. <laughs> I've got eyes everywhere. <laughs> I'm surprised one of them didn't jump you under a bus, to be honest. <laughs> Right, second set. Are we liking these? Three, two, one, go. So that's it, get your knees off. So your knees should be at the same height as your ankles. That's it, Kate, perfect. Well done, Jenny. So if you found it easier last time, put your hands out a little bit further. Bring your feet in a little bit closer. You'll find as you get that coordination with your core better, you can get everything closed up. Good toppers doing arm exercises. Three, two, one, and off. <laughs> Hold on, Benny. <laughs> hey, order some wildflowers for toppers. <laughs> what? It's an arm base. Right, one more set to go. They're distracting me again. Three, two, one, go. That's it. Lock them calls out. Well done, Debs. That's it. That's really good. You've got that locked. It's a new form of torture I've discovered. So try and slow down that shoulder tap now. Make it slower. Five, three, two, one, and off. Well done. Just do a bit of Charles pose, just to release your lower back if you need it. Get a drink, get a quick breather before we go on next one. Yeah, side planks next. And then we've just got one more after that. Yeah, I noticed these last few and knocked the cardio out of them. Right, I've changed this from last week. Is it? No. <laughs> right. It's low, wasn't it? We were doing it. Was it high? I can't remember. It, yeah. Was it low or high? I think it was high. Yeah. Yeah. Or was it low? I can't remember. No, it was low. Right, so low side plank. 
You're just resting on your top leg, your bottom leg, you're just going to move it in and out. If you can do it without touching the floor, better. If you need to slide your foot along the floor, that's fine. You're just going to do 15 seconds one leg, roll over, 15 seconds the other leg. I'm being kind to you because I made you do 30 seconds each leg. Zoomies, did you get that? Yep, cool. Right, three, two, one, pick a leg, go. So remember, hold it with your top leg. Right, if you're struggling with this one, just do a side and then switch when I say. Yep. Yeah, so if you are struggling, just do a side plank and roll over. I'll wait till everybody's over and go again. So that's it, get it up. So if you're struggling, just go straight into side plank. If you can do it, have a go at it. The reason we're doing it on your top leg is because it works a different muscle. You're now using that inner muscle, which is the adductor or adductor. Two, one, and off. Adductor. Which one's which? Which one's that one? <laughs> is that the adductor and that's the abductor when it comes in? I can never remember. <laughs> <laughs> no, <laughs> you just knock them out, don't you? <laughs> adductor, yeah. And the abductor goes up, adductor goes in. Yeah, I thought it was that way around. Right then, off we go, get yourselves up. Three, two, one, go. So lock out that top leg first, then start moving the other leg. So if you can't do the leg movement, you can just try doing it on the top leg without moving the bottom leg. If you're struggling, just do a side plank because you'll still get a little bit of that adductor doing the normal side plank. And change legs. Two, one, off you go. That's it, five seconds to go. Well done, Alex. That's good. Just slow it down a bit. That's good movement. Two, one, and off. Well done. Don't worry, they'll come. The tendency is when you do it on your top leg as well, and I, I do this at home, is to try and roll your foot over. It is better if you can put it on the, the edge. If you roll it over, you, you're putting a lot of strain on your ankle, so just put it low. I do practice these, you know. I'm not just getting you to do stuff because I've seen it on the internet. Ah. Yeah, well, there's a little bit of that. <laughs> right, last set. First leg. Three, two, one, go. We ain't got Muffety Tuffety here, have we? Because he, he likes side planks, not. Hey, it's having balance issues again. I'm not going to mention cows because I got into a lot of trouble last time. Cow toppling. And change, roll over on the side. <laughs> so that's it. Set yourselves up and go. Get your legs moving or just hold it. You're all right there, Jen. You got <laughs> that because you're rolling, rolling over. Two, one, and off. Well done. They're not easy, then, because we don't normally do them. Last exercise. Right, stay on the floor. Boat pulses. Yeah, boat, 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 boat. Right, so start with yourself, see your feet, your back's about 45 degrees. Try and make sure your back's nice and straight. You're not arching into it. So a nice upright pose there with your back. Feet at 45 degrees. All you're going to do is you can hold onto your feet, lean back a bit further, pick your feet up, and then all I want you to do is just some little pulses. 
right? If you're struggling with that, just put your hands down and just do the feet. But I want you to have a go at doing that. It's easier than it looks. Right, 30 seconds. You don't look convinced, Nick. <laughs> Three, two, one, go. Come on. It's the concentration on the faces that does me. Don't forget to breathe. This is one of those ones where you'll start holding your breath. So blow out as you pull in, breathe in as you release. Oh, we found, we found one that Ellen likes. Ellen likes this one. This is one of those ones that it's actually with a bit of practice. It's quite easy to master. And it's one of those ones, not yet, and off. <laughs> Only just. This is, one of, this is one of those ones where it's quite easy to practice and get good at it. And then when you do it at the gym, it looks really impressive. So when you're doing your own work on the patio in the summer, in your next door neighbours, they were going, cuffing, oh, look at that. <laughs> Homework, eh? <laughs> right, second set. Three, two, one, go. Let's see, let's see what. Uh... So that's it. Nice and good. Well done, Elaine. They're good. Look at them. Julia's got it. Steve's got it as well. That's quite impressive. Just focus, lock your core, pull in and out. What you'll find is at first it feels quite uncomfortable. Three, two, one, and off. <laughs> yeah. One more set to go. Right, are we ready? Three, two, one, up you go. Go. Oh, and you've got to do it in time to music. That's that's the rule. <laughs> Come on, nearly there, last ten. Don't lose it. If you lose it, back up, get back on it again. Last five. Come on, keep it going. Well done, Alex. That's it. Oh, he's in the zone. Look at him. Two, one, off. Oh. <laughs> your head was going redder and redder. <laughs> You're holding your breath. <laughs> right. Stretch down, up or down. Stood up. No. Nah. Now, right, up you get. It's going to be a quick one anyway, because we're a bit over time. It's because you've been distracting me all night. That's it. Let me just grab some uh, different music. I say, just shake your arms, shake your legs, just get nice and loose. All right, so nice and gently up, look up at the ceiling, hands together, swan dive down, keep your back nice and straight, just soft knees, take your fingers to the floor, just gentle forward fold, wriggle your bum out. So just come up halfway, look forwards. Back down again, fold. And back up again, all the way up. Hands to the ceiling. Back down, to shake your arms off. Last time up we go. Ceiling, swan dive down. Nice straight back to the floor, soft knees, fingertips to the floor. Just push your knees back gently. And forward fold a bit further. And back up again. 
Nice long stretch forwards. Make sure your feet are in tram tracks. So runners lunge, hands on your hips, body nice and upright. Just drive that heel down at the back. Make sure your knees over your ankle at the front. Now all you're going to do is just drop your hips into it, get a little bit more of a stretch, and then come out of it. And then drop back down again, try and go a little bit lower. Come out of it last time. A little bit lower again. Just hold it there. Now steady breathing and then come out all the way up, change legs all the way back again. Make sure that knee's over that ankle, drive that heel down at the back. And then just drop your, hip, drop your hips a bit. Make sure you're nice and upright. And then back out. Drop down again a little bit further this time. Breathe in, come up. Breathe out, last time all the way down. Couple of gentle breaths. And back up. All right. Take a leg up behind your knees together. Yeah, use a wall if you need it. Or find a partner. So get your knees together. Once your knees are together, drive your hips forwards. Make sure you're nice and upright. Head above the heart, heart above the hips. Just push your hips a bit further forward. Isolate that stretch down the front of your quads. One last push. Take it off. Raise legs. So knees together, set it up again. It only works if your knees are together. Make sure you're nice and upright. And push your hip forward. Get that extra stretch down your quad. Release. Shake your legs off. There. Right, arm out in front. Thumb down. Just pull it across your body. Look across your shoulder. Drop your shoulder. Let's get a bit more of a pull. And release. Shake it off. Same again on the other side. So thumb down. Pull your arm across. Just drop your shoulder and look across it. One last pull, release. So feet shoulder width apart, one arm up in the air, put it down your back, grab your elbow and just lean over and pull. So you get it all the way from your elbow, through your tricep, down your lap to your hip. Just put a little bounce in just gently, just get a little bit more stretch. And back up, change sides and over. And back up. Now yeah, we'll do all the way over. So just throw your arms over nice and high. Take your time. Get your arms right past your ears. Keep going. All right, we're going to get a little bit smaller each time now. So little, little, little tiny circles. And change direction. Still little circles. Get a little bit bigger. A bit bigger, and a bit bigger, and then go all the way over. Get them right the way past your ears again. Sit, pull your arms down by the side. Just give your shoulders a quick shake. That's it. Shake your legs, shake your arms. Well done. Awesome. Bang on that fast. <laughs> well done, everybody. Well done, Zoomies. Well done, Roomies. Thanks, Mark. You're Thank welcome. You, Mark. Bye. Thank you. Thank you. Open Thanks, Mark. Cracking up. See you later. Hoping the arms will work this week. Good. <laughs> <laughs> they didn't last. Let me know how it feels on Wednesday. Oh, it's well always done. Wednesday. <laughs> it's great.